create a new manufacturing facility for the middle and eastern United States, Tesla had a lot to consider. What's happening guys and welcome back to our channel. Tesla's Gigafactory is the machine that makes machines. These aren't just buildings with production machines inside. They're more like one unified and NASA manufacturing tool in and of itself, similar to how Cybertron is both a planet and a machine. These are the most technologically advanced and efficient manufacturing plants ever conceived, and if you don't know about it already, then let us tell you that the 2021 Tesla Gigafactory update is here. Number 5. What is a Gigafactory? 2021 is shaping to be the year of the Gigafactory for Tesla, with two currently under construction in Germany and Texas, one under massive expansion in China, and potentially one more to be announced soon. First and foremost, let's define a Gigafactory. This is Tesla's next generation of manufacturing facility, a completely new way to produce automobiles. First Gigafactory being comparable in size to all of the other lithium ion battery production. Number four, California plants, a jumble of tents. Their existing Fremont, California plant isn't a Gigafactory. It's a jumble of tents, trailers, and mischievous parts hacked together. It's not ideal, but Tesla has been doing its best to grow the original production plant in step with the growth in their product line. While they have done an admirable job, it's still not perfect. The Fremont plant's fragmented structure has undoubtedly led to some serious quality control issues over the years, preventing Tesla from ever breaking past its output limits. Factory produced 500,000 cars a year. Tesla's doing about a tenth of that at this point, but they're going to have to scale up in a big way to keep up with demand of the Model 3. Number 3. A Gigafactory in Germany We may start with Germany, where there have been a slew of new developments and a few dose of drama recently. A new factory is being built in Berlin, although it's really under the authority of Brandenburg, Germany. The big issue there recently has been the construction timetable. We had reports that this Gigafactory would be finished by late June or even early July 2021, which isn't the case as we speak. There have been rumors that completion has been delayed by six to eight more months. We've had Elon's not so subtle hinting that German regulations and approvals are holding everything up. We've had groups of protesters who believe they're protecting the world by preventing the construction of an electric vehicle plant, but it's all a bit messy. Tesla CEO announced plans for the Berlin Gigafactory in November of 2019. Decided to put uh, the G Tesla Gigafactory uh, Europe uh, in the Berlin area. Number two, poison the tap water. Environmental safeguards are at the heart of the problem. Unfortunately, because the Gigafactory site partially overlaps a drinking water protection zone and borders a nature reserve, many people have strong feelings against it and it's hard to blame them. Obviously, no one wants to poison their tap water and no one wants to hurt the local environment, but we now have some certainty. Tesla is targeting November for the factory's initial completion at which point most parts and systems will be operational, but Tesla plans to work on the factory until April 2022, possibly even later. This aligns with what Elon Musk said about a month ago when he visited the German construction site and told those present that the factory should be operational by the end of this year so that the car production line, which we expect will focus largely on the Tesla Model Y vehicle, but there's also a battery production line that's expected to be operational at Giga Berlin, and it looks like this will be the work that will continue until the spring of 2022. German environmental groups filed objection against Tesla Gigafactory permit for Tesla Giga Berlin. Number one, a new Gigafactory in Texas. The Tesla Cybertruck and the future Gigafactory in Austin, Texas go hand in hand. The building is now under construction and will be the home of Elon Musk's crazy electric pickup truck. According to earlier documents, the plant might be ready to produce automobiles as soon as May. The factory is unique for other reasons as well. It'll be Tesla's first facility in the United States constructed from the ground up 
as the automaker's only U.S. unit in California was formerly a GM Toyota joint venture. Second, the Austin facility will expand its manufacturing capacity to deliver the Model Y crossover SUV to the eastern United States. Do let us know when you guys think the 2021 Tesla Gigafactory will be completed in the comments down below. If you like this video and want to see more like it in the future, then don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, I'll catch you guys later in another video.